Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Boomer's Bees. Today is inspection day. going to do today we're going to get inside the hive whenever we put these girls in six days ago they only came with four frames they came with about two and a half frames of brood okay what brood is is just uh, all different stages of eggs and larvae okay so with that two and a half frames of brood okay my thinking is when i get in there today is the population has a chance to at least almost double in size Okay, so I'm hoping when we get in there, all right, it will have a, a population explosion, okay? And I'm also uh, looking to see uh, of the six new, brand new frames that we put in, uh, how uh, many frames that they've drawn out. So when we put them in, it was just um, the, the wax coating on the frame. And so I'm hoping that they've built out uh, a little bit and got started on that, okay? So I'm also going to check um the sugar water that we put uh on top so you can see that there's two uh there's two boxes here um the bees are only in the bottom box okay i have a feeder in this in this top box okay and so once we get in here we'll have to take the feeder off and then uh we'll inspect the hive uh further uh but with that let's get to it give them a little smoke up front just a little bit, keep them calm. Then we're gonna open them up the top. See how much sugar they have in them. Oh, they have killed this. Wow. Sugar's gone, completely gone. Now we're gonna crack the top open and get these girls inside a little bit. And we're gonna open them up. See if you guys can see in there. Well, I can already see the first mistake that I made, or I didn't keep the frames close together. I'm pretty sure I did that in the other one. Try to be nice and gentle with them. So they're starting to build out the frame on this cone. You can already see the pollen in there. Oh man, they are doing some work on this one. Wow, that is full of pollen. Got some syrup up top here. Try to flip this around for you guys so you can see it. Man, I was right. They had a population explosion in here. frame of brood.
Already got some honey up top here. I haven't seen the queen yet. I see some larvae, see some eggs. I'm gonna guess that the queen is gonna be on this next frame here. Oh, that is a heavy frame there. Frame of brood. Don't see the queen here. There's the queen. I found her. See it right up here up top? There we go. You're doing a good job. All right, let's close these girls back up. We got to get them some sugar. Okay, now we're gonna move on to the horns. See what their sugar water intake looks like. Give them a little smoke. Oh, they are empty too. Man, these girls have destroyed this sugar water. These girls have not yet had that population explosion like the Patriots have had, but they're still doing all right. They're out here to the, to the last two frames. Starting to fill this frame with pollen. Working on this side. Man, looking good. Mmm. Yeah, we had some hatchery.
Got a drone cell in the middle. Some brood. I don't see the queen yet. I do see some larvae, which is good. I see a fresh emerging bee. Okay, if I had to guess, I'm going to guess that the queen is going to be on this frame. There she is. up here on the top right pretty cool put her back in there nice and easy All right, there we go. We're gonna have to bring these girls out some more food, more syrup. The thing we are gonna have to do though, is we are gonna have to get some mite traps because I saw a couple mites in there. So we are gonna have to get some of those and put in, so. Okay, so in conclusion, uh, I think we saw a, a couple good things today. Uh, a lot of things that I'm not sure of, I'm gonna have to, to ask some people. Um, so both queens look good. It looked like they were, there was enough uh, larvae and, and eggs in there. Um, I was a little worried about them. Uh, I think they're backfilling uh, where the eggs hatched out with. I think they're backfilling with that syrup that I, uh, that I fed them with uh, on Saturday, but man, they completely uh, drank all of uh, the syrup in both uh, both hives. Completely destroyed both uh, both syrup containers. I gave them a gallon of each, and man, they they went through that so fast. Uh, so I'm gonna ask. Uh, I'm gonna have to uh, ask a couple people that I that that know a little bit more than me, and. Uh, see what they uh, think about it. But I think I got some good video today. I'm gonna ask around and, and get some things uh, squared away. But man, overall today, man, that was exhilarating. Uh, getting in there, man, the sound, I don't know if you guys could hear the sound uh, that the hive made when you opened her up, but man, it was this it was this soft humming uh, noise that was pretty cool to listen to. Um, so pretty cool day getting in there. I'll probably give them about 10 days uh, before I get into them again. Uh, but man, very cool, excited. Uh, 
for what's next uh, with these hives. Man, I am so uh, thankful for all the support that you guys have, have given me over the last couple days. Man, you guys have really got me excited uh, to start this beekeeping journey. Uh, so uh, with that, go out and be somebody.